First things first. Luca Khan, congratulations. You caught me. You caught me with a mid-air gotch-style pile driver. I tip my hat to you, sir. Seems like we are one and one against each other now. The question is now, when are we going to decide who truly is the better technical wrestler of EWU? But with that out of the way, you know, I've been sitting on this for the past couple of weeks now, ever since it was announced that I was going to be the one to take on Zaya Steele, I condemned. You know, I probably for, should feel more insulted than I do right now, but at the end of the day, I feel like being angry is kind of redundant. It's why I truly haven't gone scorched earth on anyone, even though I've come close to both Matt Draven and James Needham. But what's Aaron going to do? Hmm? It's just, just a waste of time, in my opinion. I mean, each is to their own. I mean, people have different ways in coping with things. If your way of making yourself feel better is being angry, then go right ahead. But to me, anger is just a waste of time. Zaya Steele, first things first. Congratulations. You finally reached the mountaintop, which a lot of people have been waiting for you to do. You're just like me and a lot of other guys in the back. We have fought and struggled for years, and we've had others take our stories and turn them to their own. But now, here you are. After years and years of heartache and struggle, you're now the VW World Champion. And I know some people have given you a bit of a hard time because the way you did it wasn't the most, I guess, sought after way to do it. But you had the opportunity. You had King's Gift. You told Taggart what you wanted to do before he was sent on his way. And... Lo and behold, your plan worked. You're the champ now. And I'm also not going to fault you for starting a stable. You say it yourself. You have a huge target on your back. And a lot of people are gunning for you. I mean, people who are upset with how you did it. What's done is done. There's really nothing that can be changed. Were you going to strip Zaya Steel of the belt and give it back to Sly? Hell, I, d I don't think even Sly would want that. He would much rather uh, beat you and take the belt back than just have it handed to him. But unfortunately for Sly and for you, I'm going to make sure that doesn't happen. Because when you two eventually will face off, it won't be for, for the VW World title. Because the VW World title will be in my possession. Zaya, like I said, you have worked so hard. And you have fought. And you have fought. And you have fought. But Zaya, for nine damn years, I have been on this journey. I have had opportunity stripped from me. I've had opportunities where I thought I could finally, finally reach the mountaintop only for something to knock me back down. Either because of management or because some undesirables decided to steal my story. Still, the stories of, of of Stephen Zang, of Catchpoint, of Isaiah Steele, and use those as their way to get themselves on top. But those people are now gone, and the only thing I have to say is good riddance. But like I said, Zaya, nine years, 
nine years I have had my story stolen from me. For nine years I've had to watch people who do not deserve opportunities get them. Again, I should be mad. I should be screaming at the top of my lungs, but being angry is pointless. But now here we are. You and me, I condemned. And Zaya, you have become quite the performer. You have become quite the brawler. You become quite the wrestler. But there's a difference between you and me. While you are good in the ring, I'm just going to tell you the truth. I'm better. I'm better at thinking on my feet. I'm better with submission holds. I'm better with getting out of predicaments. I have more ring awareness than you. Yes, you are a brute. You are a force of nature. But at the exact same time, that can be your detriment. You still have a lot to learn, Zaya Steel. You may now be this grizzly bear that Ben Taylor has called you. No longer a cub, but you're not an elder. You're still young. And Zaya as nicely as can put this con come condemned I'm going to walk you dry I'm going to outperform you I'm going to outwrestle you and by the end of the night I'm going to beat you now is this a guarantee no no one should ever make guarantees because Guarantees will do nothing but get you into trouble or make you look foolish. I mean, there's a still a strong possibility that you could beat me. But I like my chances. So, Zaya Steele, I hope you're ready. I hope you're ready. Because come condemned... I'm no longer looking to be a star dog. I think it's time for me to evolve. And I'm going to take a little uh, page of a uh, Thievius Raccoonus' playbook. It's time for me to become an ace.